wondering where I am, this is Yashar Film's casting office, which literally has been my home for past two years. Yeah, it's been two years since my first movie came out, and these years have been quite tough. Uh, after winning most of the promising awards uh, that year, I somehow expected offers to just flood in. Um, clearly, things didn't really um, fall into place the way I pictured. But uh, around that time, you know, Adish met me and shared his undoubted belief in my potential. And back then, you know, he even asked me if I had faith in myself, then to wait for the right project. So I waited. And waited. And waited. And soon these waiting months just turned into a whole year. And then, you know, people started speculating whether my career would fade even before it began. So after some time, Adi called me in again, where he told me that, you know, I'm penning down a script, which will be directed by someone else. And I want you to workshop for it. So after a whole long year wait, I was put on to these intensive auditioning with Shano, where I had to prepare one English movie scene and one English song every week. And I think this whole process went on for like six months. Soon after this, I was called in again uh, by Adi, where he sat me down and said, uh, you know, I was going to take another month, uh, maybe do a round of script reading before I took my final call. But, I think you already in this movie. Oh, and by the way, I'll be directing it myself. And I had no idea whether to start jumping around there or, or just <laughs> break down there and start crying or keep myself composed. And quite honestly, I don't even think that it's completely sunk in yet, but I'm so glad that my faith in myself and in him and his faith back in me got me my dream. And for all of you who sometimes you know think of giving up or giving to what you know others have to say, just hold on to your dream and watch it come alive. Just like mine.